our geodesic dome build continues. We have reached the point where we are actually entering a new phase of our build. An unknown. <laughs> Very unknown. Sill plates and extensions. The one you're standing in front of is not the one we're starting with though. No. This opening, we're also not starting with. Not yet. Ding, ding, ding. This is the winner. This is the bedroom bump out extension. We chose this one because this is our test run. It is the smallest of the three. We've got some of the wood provided by NSD and the rest of it, I think we can figure out. Think. How hard could it be? I have our very first cut list and we have hooked up our dump trailer and we're heading off to buy our first load of lumber to start our extensions. How exciting is this? <laughs> Does that, that mean, exciting. let's go then. We got our first load. Phase one. Yeah, it looks really good. It smells really good in their warehouse. Yeah. Now we just have to get this stuff home and then we can get started on our first extension build. This is one of the sheets of our architectural drawings, and this is what we're going for right now. Can put this guy in here, and this guy in here, and then we can put this guy in. Measure twice, cut once. No I mistakes on these. I think we're gonna do a little more than that, but we're probably gonna measure five times and cut six, but. <laughs> that math doesn't add up. This doesn't bode well. No. I feel the need to put our disclaimer at this point, that if we you're building a dome, <laughs> don't listen to what we're doing. If you're building anything, you shouldn't listen to us because <laughs> we don't know what we're doing. We're going to do our best and we're going to probably over-engineer just on the safe side. But yeah, mm -hmm. enough said. First cut made. Many more to go. Mm. Our first sill, Pete piece is now cut. Yeah, you know what? I'm pretty happy with that. That's pretty good. It ain't bad for a couple of noobs. <laughs> On to the next one. Okay. These are the first two sills and we are prepping them with sill gasket. Have I got that right? Yes, this is the good stuff. That will give you a good seal to adjust for any inconsistencies with the concrete. No air allowed. Correct. No air. That one needs just a little bit more, huh? Yet again. Our third shaving. <laughs> what did I tell you? Measure six, cut five. Or was it cut five, measure five, cut six? Either way, <laughs> it ain't good. We're gonna get it right though. We'll get it right. Just not on the first shot. Or the second. Or the fifth. We've been at it for six hours six or so. Ish. <laughs> we're, we're, we're close and then we're far and then we're close and then we're never close. <laughs> and my head hurts. Mm. It's the end of the day. We have two pieces cut and we cut them wrong. <laughs> oh. so. In our defense, we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> Once we tried to square it, things got a little wonky, but now we know what we need to do. But that entails going to the store and buying a new piece and recutting these first two pieces. <laughs> so our first day of extension build <laughs> was a fail. We will regroup and try again tomorrow. We'll get it tomorrow. It feels a little bit like Groundhog Day. We are going to do exactly the same thing as we did yesterday. Only better. <laughs> Only better. We do it nice because... We do it twice. Here we go. Two perfectly even pieces, I assume. You don't have to assume. Me, you measured twice. No, I didn't. I measured once. Oh. Okay, then you're assuming. Yeah. This was the step that we missed yesterday, our fatal flaw. We did not first square these pieces and make them equidistant and set at the right distance. Which was dumb. Yes. Now that we have these, 
squared properly. Now we can mark where we need to make these final trims on the inside to make it slide into place up there. We got this today. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. Yeah. This is the cut that we messed up yesterday. I think uh, hopefully we've got the angle correct today. Yeah, we're off. <laughs> Are we off? Yeah. I think we're within tolerance. <laughs> we're within tolerance, but we're <laughs> off. You didn't ooh and ah. Uh-oh. Let's see what we got here. This was board number two. Ooh. Yeah, that's right. Look at that, right on the line. It only took four tries, but we got it. Yeah, fourth <laughs> time's <a> charm. <laughs> Rubber gasket is now in place, and it is time to slide the board to its final destination. <laughs> Ow. Looks good. First one's in. Yep. On to number two. Number two is sliding into place. I need more staples. Number two is not sliding into place. Need the hammer? Yeah, I think so. Eh. A little nudge it in. We're moving on to the next board, and it's going to be the wall right here. That is this big guy. How do you want to do this? Shall we lay it on top of those boards? Yeah, and then we can draw lines and go from there. Lay it on the top. Ooh. Okay. Isn't there a lay it on the line? No, lay it on the line? How's that going now? That sounded like no blinded by the light. No. Dressed up like a Triumph. trooper in the middle. Trooper? Trooper? What? <laughs> Triumph, lay it on the line. This board goes two feet from the end, minus three quarters of an inch, so it's perfect. Don't, don't, what are you doing? Getting it to the end, because it's overhanging. It doesn't matter right now, I was just placing it. Lay it on the line. That's how it goes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We've got this one measured. Are you sure we're right? It's only a $40 board. I'm nervous about making any cuts now. Well, Don't want to mess this up. Let's measure three times then. Three times we're never going to finish this. This board is so wide that our gasket isn't wide enough. We contacted the manufacturer and their suggestion was to overlap two pieces and just trim off this little ridge on one of them. So that's what I'm going to do. These are all the sill plates for the bedroom bump out. Ta-da! It's starting to take shape. Yeah, with that laid out, it actually does. What's next? Anchor bolts. <laughs> yes, anchor bolts are next. <laughs> that has to wait, though. Yeah, it's going to rain tomorrow. More to come. Ready to give this another try? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is this, day attempt number three? Uh, Maybe four? Uh, I think it might be four. Okay. We've got the first three sill plates in place and ready for drilling. Do, 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 do. Dizzy. That's the song, right? Yeah. It's hammer time. <laughs> okay, last chance. We in the right spot? We're committed. Do it. Okay. Wait! <laughs> Kidding. How far down are you drilling? A uh, couple inches, that's it. We'll, we'll do the same for all of them, then we can remove the boards and get a proper depth. Next up, a quick blow. Yeah! You should have seen that coming. Really, I've done it before. I really should. I'm so gullible. <laughs> Ooh. 
ready to give it a final brush and then brush up brush up brush up brush up brush up brush up you know where that's from Brady Bunch nope I got chills they're multiplying uh, those lyrics can't be in the song no not in that song but in the movie I didn't watch the movie. Hey, babe. Yes? You're the one that I want. <laughs> ready to epoxy? Yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. Whatever it is. How about ready to anchor down? That'll work. Anchors away, my friend. Oh, I'm full of them today. <laughs> Definitely full of them. <laughs> I don't know what you're full of, but. I got skills. They ain't multiplying. <laughs> you were smart. You made a mark on that rod, I see. I actually was, wow, yeah. Wow, look at that. Yeah. Now we'll see if I got the depth right. <laughs> oh, that's too far. Yeah. All right. That many was too many. How many was that? Too many. Yeah. <laughs> 24, 25, 26. We're gonna have to wipe that off probably sooner rather than later because boards are going down on these. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, and nothing. The weirdest stuff always seems to happen to us. Yep. What happened? One bottle got us four and a half uh, holes. And then? Popped in the new one, filled this one up, Got her good, went to go do this one, and kept pumping and pumping and pumping and pumping and pumping, and it never filled. Either we have a huge void in our concrete, which makes no sense, or we only got a partially filled bottle, like a fraction of a filled bottle. <laughs> That's so weird. Either way, that means that we do not have that final rod in place. And, and it's partially filled, which means we're gonna have to drill that one out. It's <laughs> ridiculous. I guess that means it's cleanup time and we are done for the weekend. Because everything is closed now. Yep. Guess we'll try again Monday. Guess what? Chicken butt. <laughs> yep. Guess why? Chicken butt. Of course. Yeah. We're back. Hooray! We're giving it another go. It's going to take all of two seconds to finish this job. Hopefully this time the concrete epoxy stuff is not going to disappear on us. That would be great. I'm feeling positive. It's going to be good. Okay. I'm fine. There we go. I'm confident. Okay. Yeah. 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 The hole is cleaned and prepped and brushed and ready for the goo. Goo is coming out. <laughs> you had the lady weigh, weigh the bottles at the store yep. to confirm that they had stuff in them. She said they all weighed the same, so <laughs> let's see what happens. <laughs> I'll bet you nobody asked her to do that ever before. No, I'm pretty confident of that. All right. Who does this happen to? Us. Mm-hmm. Drum roll, please. Oh, that's oh, already doubling. progress. Yeah. Hooray! Man. All right. Whew. It didn't disappear on us this time. For a change. Nice. All right, I'll go get something to wipe the excess off, and then we can move on to the final two holes. Hooray! Well, this is another potentially fatal error on the other side. Yep. We didn't realize we put the bolt in, but once you do that, you can't, we wouldn't be able to fit the board, the sill plate down. Duh. Who's brilliant here? <laughs> so you thought about that. We were able to save it for this one. Yeah. However, the other one, not We're so in trouble. Much. Let's try putting it down first, though. See what happens. Try putting what? This in? Yeah. How are you going to do that? <laughs> physics here. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Is this physics? I... <laughs> Geometry, perhaps? <laughs> it shows the, the intelligence between the two of us. <laughs> I call it physics. And you think we could put it in. <laughs> Oh, it's amazing.
amazing that this dome is up. <laughs> I feel the need to redeem ourselves from that last bit of idiocy. <laughs> yep. We had an idea. If you can't fit it one way, try, try again. What's in the way? This is in the way of this. Ah, so close. Yeah, that won't work. We're back to calling NSD and seeing if we can cut off the top of the, or the bottom of this so we can just slide this in. I really, really tried not having to contact them to tell them we were dumb again. <laughs> I'm sorry, Derek. <laughs> All right. Uh, Give them a call. Yeah. <sighs> While we're waiting to hear back from NSD on some questions we have, show me a trick. Let me practice my Jedi mind. No, my... my force use. Okay. Ready? <laughs> Not working. <laughs> Not going. I thought I thought I saw it wiggling. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna pass out. We got the okay to go the cut route. So that's what we're gonna try doing. We are ready to move on, back yes. in the game. All right. It's going down. And it's not coming up again. No. X marks the spot. Yep. We yeah. double check the measurements. We are within code requirements. And I've marked it so I can go do the same on the other side and not have to go through this whole rigmarole. See, we can be smart every now and then. We have moments, moments. little spurts. Two more holes. Here we go. Do, 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 do. Don't screw this. <laughs> stuff and things? You? Things and stuff. Yeah. Been up to much? Trying to build a house. Mm. Yeah. That's cool. You? Oh, actually the same. We got a lot in common. We should date. <laughs> Any idea how long we have to stand here? I was going to ask you that. <laughs> mm. This might be our new home. It is going to be our new home. <laughs> Touche. <laughs> Doesn't look like much, but at least it's progress. Yeah, contractors would look at this and go. <laughs> Normal people probably are doing the same thing. Hmm. Hopefully more after the rains. That light looks nice, but what do you say we get back to our build? Um, yeah, just give me two seconds. Let there be light. Let there be light. Ready? Yeah. Well done. Thanks. It was easy. I wish the dome build went as smooth and quick. That'd be fantastic. <laughs> that would be wishful thinking. He is. We're back for more. Yeah. <laughs> it is time to start actually building our first extension. You probably shouldn't have said that. Too late. You're going to jinx us. I refuse to take it back. This is one part of the first arch. We dragged it out here and now I forget why, but it's been sitting here for a week. We were gonna set it up. <laughs> Boy, we were uh, hopeful that so day. <laughs> foolish. This is the second piece to super wall arch number one. Now that's a looky-loo. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's got a new landmark to rotate around. We've seen him fly around here periodically. This is the first time he's come right above the dome. Mm -hmm. eh, give him something down. new to look at. It'd be awesome if he stops at a low. <laughs> Two pieces are put together. So the next step is to nail those boards so it locks them tight, right? Not nail, screw. Screw? So we can undo. Yeah. Screw so we can undo. Yes. So what did we learn today? Don't jinx things, right? Yes. What happened? Apparently I jinxed things. Yes, you did. We just measured this arch and we are 
six inches too wide and that's after pushing it as tight as it goes mm -hmm. hmm. so what do we do now Derek <laughs> that is a pretty arch yes it is that we will never use we will not <laughs> we just got off the phone with our NSD contact and um, they were super helpful and we cleared up the confusion that this is indeed the wrong size for our opening. They are going to cut us some new wood and send it to us so that we can have the correct sizes. Yep. So it's gonna be a little bit of a delay, but they'll make it right and we will move on from there. In the meantime, maybe that will just force us to start in on the porch. Yeah, we're gonna, we'll do. So it's a little bit of a bummer, but as always, we figured out and it'll all work out. Yep. Our trials and tribulations are your entertainment. Are you not entertained? You don't know that references, do you? No. Gladiator. That was entertaining. Bye-bye. If you enjoy our videos, we'd really appreciate it if you would take a second and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. And until next time, like our farm sign says, just keep growing.